Good morning and welcome to school today. It's our last day of school before Christmas break with two weeks off. I hope you are all caught up and you'll be able to spend the next two weeks just playing and resting and reading a little bit every day. All right, so let's get our day started by standing for the pledge to the flag. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Let's see who's celebrating a birthday today. It is the 18th of December. Oh, I got to the 17th yesterday, and I forgot those. Oh, we don't have any 18th birthdays. We do have lots of folks who have birthdays over Christmas break, so happy early birthday to Tilly King, Maddie Buffin, uh, Kenaya Young, Addison Piercy, Rayleigh Shields, Eliana Young, Jonathan Saparito, Landon Dunaway, Malachi Berry, Timothy Martin, Ozzie McDaniel, Jacob Miller, Chloe Logan, uh, let's see, Elliot Todd, Cash Carmichael, Caden Stugan, John Hager, Braden Hager, and then also um, over Christmas break, Mr. Fannin celebrates a birthday, and so does Miss Nisano. Actually, theirs are, let's see, like early next week. Yes, Monday and Tuesday, I believe, too. So, And then Miss Hall celebrates a birthday on uh, the New Year's Day. So, But we'll be back by the time, we'll be back on the 4th, and we'll do all those guys probably at that point, too. So um, don't forget that our manner is when you're on a um, virtual kind of thing, or actually even when you're in your classroom, make sure that you're sitting so the teacher can see all of your face, okay? So not slouching in your chair or hiding your face with a book, any of those things. Let's make sure that we sit so that our teachers can see all of our face. All right, I'm hoping that you are all cut off with eye ready. If you're not, get that done because we sure don't want to start with getting um, back together, like trying to do that stuff and our new stuff coming in January. I know that you probably got the letter from Mr. Moore yesterday that says we aren't going to go back to real person or in-person learning until at least the 11th. So we'll start right back here on the 4th of January 2021 and let's hope it's better. Um, and we will um, start back with EDL with our virtual learning on that day at 9 o'clock. But I'll send some reminders to your moms and dads. Um, but for right now, we're just worried about um, Christmas break, having some time off, okay? So our fifth grade team put on, just like they have every year for the last eight years, or this is the eighth year of it, um, We have they've done a... Um, ugly sweater contest with the children okay so they had to pick a different way to do it this year and I think I sent or I'm going to send you guys the different con contestants for those and um, so your teachers can show those to you if you want to um, and so I we've got the winners for those all right they have one two three four five six different categories um, and you guys did a fabulous job with those um, and your teachers will touch base with you on all of that but um, the light uppiest winner is Ivy Tarasik the jingliest winner is Chris Collins. The Christmasiest winner is Oakland Epperson. The originaliest is Christian Dart. And uh, for a brand new category uh, this year, the techno coolest, and this one was tricky because they were very cool virtual sweatshirts. But what I really loved about Aubrey was that she put her face in the sweater, so that was really, or on the, you know, like like she was wearing the sweater. That was Aubrey Jones, and then the winner for the teacheriest, my very own grand cat nephew, Brett Favre, who is not a hockey player. Just so you know, I know that too he's a football guy so but he's very cute he's at the end of the video and honestly he was really cuter than all the teachers so when you see it you'll think the same thing as well we've got a shout out from miss wagner to some of her students they uh, were respectful they showed respect great participation in group discussion and activity carson matthew thomas sadie jordan zach Gabe, Sophia, Nick, Luciano, Cabrin, Caitlin, Kaylin, and Brayson. Great job, second graders. All right, so um, let's see. We're going to finish up our joke book today. I think so. Um, no, that one's silly. What do grapes sing at Christmas? Tis the season to be jelly. Not jolly, jelly. <laughs> Somebody just tickled my forehead there, so... Why did the girl tell jokes at the skating party? To break the ice. <laughs> I like that one. Why did Santa's sleigh turn left? Because the sign said, bear right. Usually that means stay on the road to the right, but Santa must have thought it was a great big bear there. Uh, where does Dracula shop for Christmas gifts? At Bed Bat. 
and beyond. And da -da -da, what do snowmen like best about cake? They're like me, the icing. All right, I think that's the first time we've gotten through the whole Christmas joke book, so I'm pretty proud of ourselves for that part too. So, so we've got two weeks off, boys and girls. You guys have really done a great job of um, tuning in and doing your work. So many of you have just kept up with this, just like it was regular school, and I could not be prouder and so proud to be your principal because you've done such a great job with this. Your teachers have worked super hard, um, pro you know, providing things for you, and then I know they've done some really fun things this week. I've gotten to see some of the pictures that teachers have. Um, done with their classes so we'll try to post some of those activities as well but thank you for being the best boys and girls in Jessamine County probably even in the whole wide world I appreciate your hard work I want you to take two weeks off I want your teachers to take two weeks off I want your um, parents to not worry about school for two weeks and when we come back on the fourth we'll figure it all out okay so Merry Christmas Happy New Year I will see you guys in 2021 um, so do all the things you need to do today until we're done with our school day and I will see you guys on the fourth love you guys